Millions of Spanish women stayed off the job on Thursday in the first ever women's strike in Spain. They're fighting against wage inequality. Men are typically paid more than women for the same kind of work. They're fighting against domestic violence. More than 100 women have been killed in this just in the past year. And they're fighting against sexual harassment. Now, later in the day, tens of thousands of Spanish women took to the streets in Madrid, here in the capital, in Barcelona, and in more than 100 cities across the nation to make their voices heard. The two big unions said five million women took part in partial two-hour strikes on their work shifts. Many others took the whole day off. Their aim, not to do any work at the workplace, not to do any work at home, the housework and taking care of the kids. All of this coming as the international movements um, have empowered Spanish women, the international movements like the Me Too movement against sexual harassment, the Time's Up movement in favor of pay equality in the workplace. All of that helped fuel this movement this day. There were also demonstrations in France and in Italy and across Europe. Here's what a few women had to say about why they're participating. We want to work, live in peace, to have the same rights as any man, because we are people, and as people we have the same right to protest. We cannot be demeaned, and we must not be afraid to go out. It scares society, and also many women, when they realize how strong we can be, especially when we are together. That's why I will strike, and that's why I am here. The European Union says that Spanish women typically make 13 percent less than men for doing the same kind of work at the same job in the public sector and 19 percent less in the private sector. And women typically do much more free work, if you will, uh, tending to the home, uh, housework, tending to the children, to the elderly in the family, than men, according to the Spanish government. But Many women said they couldn't really afford to go on strike this day because they would lose a day's wage. That is a, a sign that they have more part-time jobs and more temporary jobs that give them less protection in a strike. One woman saying that if she took off and lost a day's wage, that was enough to feed her family for several days forward. So the road to equality, experts say, is not an easy one. Al Goodman, CGTN, Madrid.